Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Dean. If you're new here, hi, how are you? Hope you guys are having a beautiful, beautiful day. It is almost 4th of July. What are your guys' plans? Are you guys excited? Do you guys not care for it? You guys feel you're too old now, you know, people just don't celebrate the holidays like they used to. But, in other good news, my little one is turning five on Wednesday. She is super excited. She is counting nine... Uh, counting down the days she's like oh one more day two more days five more days i'm like no girl two more days but my little one will be five and i am trying not to go down memory lane and look at her pictures and cry yeah but i just want to say thank you guys so much also for the love and support that you guys have been showing and today we're gonna get into it's always sunny philadelphia season 12 episode 6 but without further ado, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell so you can notify when I pop up on your screen. And I'm a little nervous. Let's see what the gang is up to today. What's going on with you? Are you limping? Ah, uh, no, I've just been working out on this new exercise bike I got. Sorry, I have the hiccups. But that's so funny that it's a Monday on a Monday. I love when I hit those. My body. Mm -hmm. It's very windy today, isn't it? Did you just step in that on purpose? Why? Oh, no, I just, you know, I didn't really see it. No, folks are stupid. I don't. I was just in the ah. It was just an accident, man. People step no. in dogs accidentally all the time. Is, is that a lottery scratcher? Those mirrors? No. Way. You creep. He had mirrors on his Crocs. <gasps> For rank. Wow. <laughs> Holy oh, shit. God! What the frank? What the hell was that? What? I see. Now, Charlie, when Charlie kicked Mag, Mag has poop on his Saved shirt. your life. You used the slur, dude. That's like a hate crime. Yeah, that's hateful you speech, really man. Denied. Oh, shut up. You don't deserve anything. Dude, excuse no. me. Hey. I mean, yeah. we have our differences, but we settle them in house. Sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Process. There's filibusters, the whole thing. Someone Ooh. to hear us out and deliver a final okay. verdict. That's, mm -hmm. you, yeah. that's, that's you. you. That's you. That's I saved your life. But you used a slur. It was a slur. You'd be dead if I did. Oh, if we if we're being realistic here, Frank could have just yelled out Mac, and he still would have saved his life. So for him to say like, oh, you'd be dead if I did it. No, Frank. If you weren't called him by his name. You still could have saved his life. It's about like, this. Uh, <laughs> a two dollar scratcher lottery ticket. About which of you is entitled to a two dollar scratcher? Now you're getting it. He's yeah, getting he's it. Getting yeah. it. Yeah. What? I thought we were here to know if it was a hate crime or if Frank was a hero. And we're talking. Mm. Each one of us feels that we're entitled to that ticket. We need you to tell us who it belongs to. Okay, so he's not getting what? it. What? Yeah. Okay. You're not right. on the job? Hold on, is it Phil? Potential. Yeah? Promise. The very foundation upon which this group rests. I, are you amazing? Was one half mine. But if I'm being honest, I thought I could be wrong. But I thought it came out of D D's purse when she dropped it. So technically, isn't it D's? Or did it come out the book that D put in her bag? Each of you will have an opportunity to plead your case. Okay. How about that. Do we all agree to those terms? <laughs> the other guy was not our style. Well, I'm very happy to do so. They now, the ticket in question, uh, who purchased it? Me. And therefore, the ticket belongs to me. Agreed. And as I was putting my book into my purse... You purchased the ticket two weeks ago. I did. And why hadn't you scratched the ticket? But as long as you don't scratch it, then you're not a loser. Hmm. You know, in fact, you're a winner. So what are you talking? You just pathetic. said this exact same uh, thing like 10 minutes ago. Well, hold on a second. Motion for sub arbitration to determine whether or not that's sad. Mo point out that while D's version is the truth, it's not the whole truth. The candy sour worms, the pack of cigarettes. No, yeah. I don't think so. I mean, I think you're getting pretty tubby in the midsection. What? It's like yeah, a bird. Oh, no. Well, at least I have a 46% chance of getting Parkinson's disease Girl. according to a DNA test I took. According to that, Smoking can reduce your risk. Oh my God, who gives a sh But your elbows are a mess. They're too sharp. I don't like it. They're stabbing me. That's what it you is. Got it. And that's you not got the point. It. You see, Dee and I had a deal. I give her money for coffee every morning on the way to work. This is from my boss, Dennis. It's all a very choreographed dance between two soon-to-be to lovers. Involved with oh. Cassie is not underage. Cassie is 21 years old. So, you see, I was waiting for wow. Cassie to mature. 
much like an IRA. Uh, okay, yeah, sure. Before full maturity, yeah, that's where you're wrong. No, I was uh, between the ages of 18 and 21, simply making investments. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, come on, uh, man. Just, uh, really? Okay, just to be clear, a deposit's a load. But no, no, with my, no look, wow. not in this particular case. It's not a load. It, it's D has no rightful claim to that ticket, and I'll prove it. See, yes, Cassie never gets her tip, does she, D? No, because I refuse to tip for coffee. We all know what that means about the ticket in question, don't we? It's Dennis' money. She bought it with my money. Mm -hmm. So technically, that ticket is mine. OK, OK, OK. Ticket with Mr. Reynolds' money. But Mr. McDonald currently possesses it. Correct. We were, right? We were just walking down the street, minding our own business. I just Step spotted on. the perfect <laughs> pile of dogs. Voluntarily step into the dog feces. Well, I didn't really. You just said you, you did. So that I would smell of dog sh why? Abby? Oh, no. Well, now I have more of questions. Of course you do. Like, why did you let a skunk spray you? To cover the smell of cologne. Man. Smoking with D! All right, fine, I said it. Oh, oh, okay, so right, so you thought we would care about those wow. smells. Because if the sh is a matcher, Charlie gets the uh, scratcher! Oh, what the oh, shit? Oh, Bad, look, oh. give me a cigarette, I'll cover it up. But look, if it smells like you shit, know, you must have uh, quit. You know what, we all know that it is because everybody saw you kick me. We're debating whether or not you actually saved my life. Yeah. Wait, yeah. one flip! Here we go, I, the I man is never all the time. Never cool. We do it. Minding my own business, Being bird watching. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's really. He wasn't really bird watching. He was looking up women's skirts. He peeps on women. That's yeah, he's he's pretty gross. The point is that I said, "Look out, faggot," which were the words that saved Max's life. Why did you use the slur instead of just yelling your friend's name? Exactly. There was a lot going on. Everybody knew to look at Mac. Look out, faggot! Who kicked him in the chest? Knew to look. Hell, they have been effective, but it was an offensive slur. To save somebody's life. Really, any language. Yes, I mean, to let a man die over a word. Yeah. Frank, tell me something. If you were going to save somebody else's life, mm -hmm. you know, from a falling piano. Uh, I suppose. Yeah, you know what, we're, uh. Charlie, you can't yes. use that I'm word. I'm trying to guess no, the no, word no, that no. he was saying no, that he thought Frank was going to say. Yeah. Yeah. I've been casually throwing the F word around willy nilly for the past few days, and that hasn't been a problem. But a faggot. Uh, is a burning bundle of sticks on top of which they used to burn homosexuals. All right, that's uh, that's yes. pretty dark. Yeah, yeah that's, that's dark. Yeah, yeah it's yeah, pretty yeah, dark. Yeah. Yeah. How about we just call each other by names, and if you don't know them, Jen, just don't say nothing. I'm directed towards a woman when you're yes. trying to insult oh, her. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> when you're trying to make a woman <laughs> feel small. All right, fine. Well, then we're gonna take away your favorite word. Yeah. Yeah. Sucker. Yeah. yeah. What's wrong with that? Exactly. <laughs> There's <laughs> nothing offensive about sucking. Half the population loves to suck. Okay. In terms. Of the ticket. Yes. I'm calling bullshit on Frank, which makes him a bigot. Oh, wait, catch me up here. So Mr. Reynolds um, simply was just trying to disrespect you. Frank thinks Mac is gay because Mac is gay. Frank. The closet, yeah, he's out of the closet. Yeah. I mean, we don't like you either way. Oh, look, now I care about my body. So just, let me just, uh, let me put this to bed, okay? Mac, we're in support of it. So just come on out of the closet. What? <sighs> We found the bike. What about it? What bike? Oh, Mac. Go get the bike. I'm gonna go get the bike. Mac's bike. Yeah. Sure. Well, just just like any other workout bike. Uh, uh, I, there you go. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. Hey, but it is not what it looks like. Yeah, what it looks like is that you are with a dildo bike. No, you're not understanding. I modded out a regular workout bike to create the optimal workout. I see where you guys are getting off the rails. That's not a penis. Uh, oh. What is it? It's a uh, no. Imagine you're riding up a steep hill and you've already been working. So you go to sit down, it pushes you right back uh, up into your workout. Uh, the ass pounder 4,000 will never let you rest. The pounder never stop oh. pumping. I've certainly learned something. This, this has nothing to do with being gay. I have one of those. Yeah. <laughs> whatever. Oh, whatever. You guys are just jealous. Because what are you talking about? Do you don't. Are you crazy? What am I Can somebody just scratch the ticket at this point? Because they're fighting probably over nothing. That ticket party has zero dollars. Just to be entirely just, I will make my decision based on 
Fairness? I think I'm all caught up. All right, so what's the verdict? Yeah, what do you got? I think it's actually pretty straightforward. He would not be in possession if his life were not saved by Mr. Reynolds. Who hero! Oh, I'm a hero! Get the man out of the way! Nothing for the man who paid for the ticket! I bought it! I'm Technically hate speech, since Mr. McDonald does not claim to be gay. Uh, oh? Go. I was gonna say, what if Mac did claim it just to get it and look it? I claim to be gay! No! Oh, oh, no, 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 There's a history oh. behind this. Mark fair. my words. Yeah, no, he's gotta, if Holy he's gonna shit. do it, he's gotta stay out, which it, he won't, it, I guarantee. Fine, whatever. Yeah, I'm out. Probably worth okay. it, whatever, dude. Sure. Let's, uh, let's see what we have here. Okay. You're a winner. What? Well, how much? $10,000. No. All right, if you will just sign this, releasing the ticket and agreeing to my ruling. Pounder 4,000, it's all going right Wait, into the product. Mean, yeah, the yeah, ticket. sign the paper. Just go yeah. back in the closet. Do it now. It's gonna hurt. Well, you're going to do it, so you might as well just do it. Yeah. It doesn't matter. You can just go back in. You sign the yeah, paper. Yeah, I mean, you got your money. No, I think I'm out now. See you guys. Whew. Is he serious? Good for him. I'm, Absolutely. I'm happy for him. Yeah, it's a relief, honestly. It would be a bill. <laughs> Oh, money stuff. Uh, that goes to Frank. I know it's steep, but... What's it add up to there, Frank? The $9,986. Yikes. Oh, holy... So Let's let him pay for it. That's a great idea. That's it, fair. That's yeah. fairness fair sake. Yeah. yeah. He's got the money for it. I did just come out over a $14 scratcher. That's hey. all that's left? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. It's not a gay or straight thing, no, is it? it's a back thing. Yeah, it's a back thing. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. This episode, um... Wow, um, it was it was funny, but I need to know your guys' opinion. Is it a hate crime or is Frank a hero? Do you guys believe that Max should have won that ticket? I need to know your guys' opinions because I love when we do these because you guys go in deep and you guys get serious and it's so funny. But let me know down in the comments below. And I do have a Patreon for full episodes if you guys want to head over there. Until next time, Jabronis, bye.